What's going on guys, my name is Drew and welcome to episode 6 of this Gladbach save here in Germany. Uh, today's live match is against Hoffenheim, but let's see how we've got on since the Mainz game. And uh, yeah, we are struggling. So let's have a look at our schedule so far. So since that Mainz game, which was obviously that 2 all draw, and you can see what we've done before then, we've kind of carried on that theme. We did manage to get a win, that was the cup match against Paderborn. Uh, we won that in extra time, 2-0, thanks to Johnson and Player. And we're through to the quarterfinals where we'll play against Bochum. After that Mainz game, we had a very difficult game against Leipzig. We lost that one 2-0, obviously Timo Werner. Still at Leipzig, he's not gone to, to Chelsea yet, so he did the business against us. They they obviously had nine on target. We didn't really do much through the whole game, so uh, a disappointing loss there. Next game we played was a disappointing draw against Cologne. We registered seven shots on target, but it was quite a drab affair. Uh, 6.5s around our sort of strikers uh, on that one, and that's going to be a bit of a theme, I think really struggled even though i know we've got some decent strikers we've really struggled to score our chances where we've had them so obviously uh, that's something we need to look at but i think also trying to find a tactic that works i have mixed around with different ones which is probably not helping but yeah disappointing draw there next game was a frustrating draw again uh, against fortuna dusseldorf uh, one all there we scored uh, just before half time but frustratingly, they scored on 88 minutes and there's literally nothing you can do when they score that late. And obviously that was the theme sort of early on in the season, especially sort of first game against uh, Schalke, I think it was. Uh, they had quite a few more shots than we did, so probably we should have lost that game. So probably lucky to get through with the draw in the end. But again, strikers-wise, 6.3, 6.4. So failing to take our chances is definitely a theme for us that so far this season. Next game for us again, so another another defeat. I didn't think we were going to lose this one, to be fair, against Sparta Prague, but we've lost the first knockout round of the Europa League. And, uh, yeah, disappointing. Uh, we scored on six minutes. I thought uh, that was going to be enough, um, and we were going to push on from there. Uh, 19 shots for us, six on target. But then we conceded on 36 minutes, and again we conceded right at the end of the game, where I couldn't literally do anything to, to counteract it performance is better in terms of our strikers but yeah conceding those goals late in games seems to be a theme for us and hopefully we can get a, a win today a bit so today's game obviously is the Hoffenheim match so let's get into it so this is the team we're going to go with today so we're going to have Maya behind our two strikers hopefully we can get some uh, goals out of them today uh, 13 for Turam actually this season and 9 from Bolo but as you can see through those last games in terms of their sort of overall ratings they've been pretty poor. Um, one thing to mention we've brought in um, Ida, is that how you pronounce his name? Not sure if it is. Brought him in on loan uh, from Norwich, uh, potential current ability 2.5 stars, obviously potential 4 star but I was looking for another striker who could maybe do the business for us. Um, has decent finishing, I suppose, 15, um, good acceleration at 16. So we'll have to see how he gets on this season, but it'll probably be a backup unless we still can't get our strikers to, to score some goals and we might actually give them a, a few chances uh, maybe to start games. So they're playing a 4-2-3-1. We've gone for a very narrow tactic today, 5-2-3 uh, with wing backs. Let's see how we get on in this one. Hopefully, fingers crossed, we get a win today because we desperately need it. Wow, I thought we were going to concede then in the first six minutes. Hoffenheim are a difficult team, to be fair. Where are they in the league? Well, they're actually below us. They're 13th on 23 points. So we should really win this game, in theory. And Bolo's in. Straight at the goalkeeper, that is how we've been playing this season. A lot of shots going straight at the goalkeeper or miles wide. Meyer with the cross and Bolo heads over. Johnson's pushing forward, pulls a ball back for and Bolo. That gets his 10th uh, goal of the season. This is better. Maybe I should just live stream all my games. Maybe that's the luck I need at the moment. Good finish from Mbolo. No chance for the keeper there. Good pull back from Johnson as well. So approaching half-time, we almost went 2-0 up then. 
and Bolo missing the header. And that's half time, 1 0. I feel we've played a lot better in this game so far, but we know what normally happens. Unless we get uh, a couple more, or at least one more, we're probably going to concede right at the end of the game because that seems to be our luck. Almost 60 minutes played, still that 1 0 lead. So nervous when it comes towards the end of the game because because of that precise reason. I mean, he's absolutely smashed that. Sommer, I don't think, have much chance, although I don't think he should be getting beaten at his near post like that. He was really he put that in the top corner, and Sommer was on his knees. Frustrating again from us. 62 minutes in. I think this is confidence. Don't let them. Cons is that offside? There's got to be offside. It's not offside. Has he scored? Surely he's not scored from there. Did Kramerich get a touch on that? Oh, wow. That is shocking. How have we conceded that? This could be a very short... Uh, a, sh a very short series on YouTube. Oh wow, this is frustrating. 17 minutes in. We've had 15 shots again, but only four on target. This has been our problem. We've, we have plenty of shots. Just can't seem to take any of the chances that we get. Seven off target. Two clear cut chances and we're two one down. I'm pretty worried about where this, uh, this season's gonna go at this rate. And Sommer seems to be conceding some really weird goals as well. For a for a decent stri uh, goalkeeper, he seems to concede goals. <laughs> oh wow! I mean, we get we need to get Europa League football. I might have a little look after this game at the job centre front and see if we're insecure or anything. I think my last rating was a C. What a terrible result that is. At home as well. Any advice, guys, would be much appreciated. Obviously, drop them into the, the comments, but I don't seem to be able to get a, a formation to work. It's not like we're not having chances either. 15 shots for us, 7 on, seven off target, 4 on target. I thought with that uh, goal on 29 minutes, but it's always this. We always concede, and we con seem to concede these weird goals, like you've seen. Stay, it says stable and secure. But, I mean, looking at this, I'm not sure, I'm not sure. We need to win this next game in the uh, Europa League. So yeah, so frustrating at the moment. Uh, what I'm going to do now is play through until, well, maybe the Leverkusen game if I get allowed that sort of uh, that sort of time. So yeah, I think I'll come back for the Leverkusen game, which is on the 21st of March. So guys, if you've enjoyed episode six, please make sure you like, comment and subscribe and obviously check out on the YouTube channel for previous episodes to catch up with how we've been doing. But obviously you can see see how we've been getting on here. Um, fingers crossed we do get to record another episode and we don't get uh, sacked in between.